On this episode, we're going to talk about the power of video. Welcome to the Creative Genius Podcast. My name is Sherwin Van Gunster, and I will be your host. Video is 93% more effective than any other form of advertising. To give you some context into this, I started a media company specializing in both photography and videography. However, when I first started over 10 years ago, it was very hard for me to get into the field. I didn't have the skills and I didn't have the opportunities. So when I first started, I decided to reach out to uh, my friends, people within my network and said, hey, would you give me the opportunity to take photos for your business? By doing this, I did a lot of free work and it gave me the ability to learn new skills. It gave me uh, a lot of training and helped me out with researching how to do new things. Um, I didn't go to school for this by any means. However, by adapting to working in different conditions, working with new clients, working for different establishments, it gave me the experience. And what I was able to do from that was to be able to put myself in a position to set up my own company. I'm able to now charge for my services and I've had the pleasure of um, working for companies like New York Minute, which is a burger franchise, as well as companies like Unibet, which is one of the biggest betting agencies. And from there, I also got the opportunity to do some work for um, Australia's premier mixed martial arts company, Hex Fight Series. Going back to the power of video, video was traditionally used on TV, and now with the growth of social media, we're seeing an influx of video on platforms like Facebook, Instagram, and Snapchat, to name a few. Video is used for a lot of branding and advertising. With the growth of social media, we're now seeing this being used by both small businesses and large businesses. And this is basically evened out the playing field. When using video for platforms like Facebook or YouTube, there are limited restrictions. However, using a platform like Instagram, you need to be aware that there are video restrictions for time limits. The ideal time limit for an Instagram video varies from 15 to 30 seconds. And there are also restrictions on video dimensions. So make sure you have a look at that before posting a video to Instagram. To get around these restrictions on Instagram, you can use IGTV. IGTV has its own video dimension restrictions. However, it gives you the ability to put up a video for up to 10 minutes with a 650 megabyte upload restriction. I often get asked, how do you create content and where to start? Nowadays, it's made easy. You can pick up a phone and record content anywhere that you are. You can go live, you can record a video that you can post to social media later. If you want something a bit more professional, you can go for an approach like a DSLR or a mirrorless camera. Nowadays, they are much more affordable than what they were, and they give you the ability to put out great, engaging content. Apart from having great video, it's very important to have crisp and clean audio. For this, you have options like run and gun mics, lapel microphones, and condenser microphones. Before you start though, you can check out YouTube There's a lot of great reviews from other content creators about what equipment they use, and you can definitely have a look at what options will suit you best. Another thing to keep in mind with audio is if you're gonna be using any background music, make sure that it is royalty free. This is very important to avoid copyright infringements and your videos getting taken down. A great platform to check out is Soundstripe, as they offer a wide variety of music from all different genres and moods. Thanks for tuning in to the Creative Genius Podcast. If you have any questions, please feel free to drop them in the comments below. And don't forget to like, share and subscribe.